In this video, you'll learn how to initialize fields with default values when a new node is created at runtime. We'll use the built-in node insertion link of the ASPX tree list and handle its init new node event to pre-populate the record's fields. So let's get started. I'll start with an ASP.NET application that has an ASPX tree list control bound to an access data source. The access data source is bound to the departments table of the departments.mdb database. First, I'm going to enable runtime node insertion on the tree list. I select the ASPX tree list control and open its smart tag. I click on the enable inserting checkbox. You can see that a new command column is created and a new link appears for each row. I run the application to demonstrate the default behavior. I click on a new link and I'm presented with the fields for a new node in the tree list. While this might be the desired case for many scenarios, there may be times that you would want your web application to automatically pre-populate some of the fields with default data. Let's see how to implement the code to do this. I close Internet Explorer and return to Visual Studio. I select the tree list and create a new handler for its init new node event. This event is raised when an end user starts editing a new node. This occurs when the start node editing or client side start edit new node methods are called, as well as when an end user has clicked on the new command button. Within the event handler, I set the value for budget. For this example, I want the new department to have a budget of 500,000 by default. I'll also set the default value for the location field of the new node. Let's have all new departments be in Monterey. And I'm done. I run the application again to see the results. I click on the new command button and you can see that the budget and location fields are pre-populated with the default values I specified earlier. For more information, please refer to the ASPX tree list documentation. Thanks for watching and as always, thank you for choosing DevExpress.